Hello everyone, my wonderful friends, lovers all over the world. Welcome to this chit chat. Um, today is a wonderful day. It's a special day, January the 31st, 2023. Or let me say January the 31st, I mean the last day of January of every year. It's a wonderful, wonderful and a special day to me. Because it had to be my, you know, it has to be my birthday. And actually, well, my own philosophy in life, I don't usually attach importance to, you know, some things that the status quo has it to be. Because I believe that everything that the Lord has made is good. God himself said he made all things and then everything was good in his sight. But be that as it may, we are humans and then we, you know, we are infested with bias. And that is why we have importance, I mean, we attach importance to uh, different things, events, days, place of birth, achievements, and the likes. So such is the birthday. And that is why I must not also fail to acknowledge the goodness of God in a more special way today being my birthday. So, for those of you that um, are wondering who is speaking, I am Ashegun Oluyemi, Enoch. Some call me Ashek's Baba, some call me Uncle Ashek's, some call me Ashegun. Uh, in all, I'm Ashegun Oluyemi. As you see uh, that this uh, platform bears, it bears that name Ashegun Oluyemi. And today, January 31st, is my birthday. So, happy birthday to me! Thank you. I have that nudge in my spirit to do this video to serve as an encouragement, to serve as a source of motivation, to serve, uh, uh, to, to, to serve as uh, a form of soul lifting to people that are depressed, people that have heaviness of heart. Because uh, God told us through Prophet Isaiah in Isaiah 61, verse 3, that He has given us the oil of gladness, the oil of joy, and the garment of praise. For the spirit of heaviness. So it is the garment of praise, it is the attitude of praise that removes from us, that takes us out of that depressing, bad situation. So um, let me just give you a little peep into myself. I am Asher Guliemi, as I've mentioned. I am a Christian, a born again child of God, by the grace of God. And the Lord called me into his glorious work of soul winning of evangelism through the media, particularly through drama, through the tool of drama. And the Lord has been helping us. By the grace of God, I serve under the Proclaimers of Righteousness Evangelical Ministries, you know, abbreviated as PREM. That is a ministry God handed over to his servant, Evangelist Femi Adebile Fejus Baba, who runs Fejus Baba TV as well, the channel that serves you with, you know, uh, seasoned and inspiring gospel movies all right <laughs> so i i hail from Oyo state i hail from Oyo state and then i schooled in Oyo state you know my, my my education the primary the secondary and the tertiary were in Oyo state and then i served and then um, we are still moving on when it comes to our academic pursuit we are still moving on ministerially god is helping us so much you know to uh deliver divine mandates to those he has created. It is not in the mind of God for anybody to perish. It is not in the mind of God for anybody to lose his soul in hell. Scripture says, What shall he profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? What shall he give in exchange for his soul? So today I just want you to know that I am a product of God's grace. I mean, God's riches at Christ's expense. I am a product of that. My journey in life has been a testament to what God can do with a man who he has graced. So I'm a product of God's grace and um, I'm not perfect. I am so much, very much dedicated to the cause of the kingdom of God. And to you, my viewers, you're watching me presently now. I just want to use these, you know, when birthdays have been done, when people celebrate their birthdays, gifts are being shared, you know, fun and merrymaking but today i want you to have this as a token for my birthday 
that you are created for a purpose and God loves you. That is why he created you into this world. You are not in any way a mistake in this cosmos. And for you to be able to be useful, for you to be able to realize that mandate that God has given unto you, you need to submit the talent, you need to submit the gift that God has given to you to the feet of God. You need to submit it and before you even submit that gift, the first thing is for you to submit your life, hand over your life over to God through Jesus, his son who came as a propitiation, as a substitute for our sin. So the best gift you can give me today is by you giving your life over to God, handling your whole to him surrendering everything at his feet and you are going to see how he's going to pick you up make your life a wonder announce you by himself to the whole world you cannot announce yourself to the world you cannot make yourself relevant by yourself you can't do this with your own strength or by your own power but you can only do this by the strength of the lord the scripture says he picked the children of those who are let me say children of the poor they, 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 they rejected, they abandoned. God is the one that picked them from the dung hill and brings them to sit with the princes and the kings. That is what you can do for me today to revisit your life, take a stock of your life, have a rethink through your journeys in life, what you have been through. And then you now say, Lord, I come to you and I surrender my life unto you. Use me as you want. And then God is never a disappointment. He always lives up to his expectation. He always lives up to his promises. He is not a man that he should lie. He said in his word, Come unto me, all you that labor and are heavy laden. And I will give you rest. In the rest of God that is promised through Jesus Christ lies happiness, lies fulfillment, lies wealth lies peace joy prosperity and a host of other things that can be termed as good in this cosmos as i'm rounding up this um today is my birthday your prayers your wishes your gifts whatever that you have to celebrate you know god in me is welcome i want to uh, also tell you that after this video now you're going to be watching a musical video very powerful one it is titled the king of goodness or bairi hmm. or bairi it's it's a token of appreciation to my god reminiscing you know about where god has brought me from and where i am now and where he still has to take me to no i i you know i count it as a rare privilege to have been able to make that video as a token of appreciation to god and also as a platform and also as a platform or as a seed or by extension, a point of contact to every one of you who will align with what I'm saying, you know, who will, who will, will relate, will be able to relate with what I'm saying, thinking far back into your past, thinking about the mistakes, about the successes, about the failures, about your shortcomings, and then giving the glory back to God, extolling Him. It's like a love letter to my God. So I enjoy you to sit back and watch the wonderful music rendition. It's in Yoruba language, but we have done well to subtitle it, you know, in English for all our non-Yoruba speakers. So in closing, I just want you to do this wherever you are watching, you know, from all around the world at this time. As I'm rounding up this video, I want to pray with you. I want to pray for you. So wherever you are, I just want you to close your eyes. You can, if you have any challenge in your body, if you have any uh, issues with your life, if you have any prayer request that you have been praying to God, if you have any uh, desire or a kind of concern in your mind that, oh God, when will you do this? If you have the prayer request written in pieces of paper, you can just bring them out now. You know, as you close your eyes, you can put your hands on them. And we're going to pray in faith together. I'm going to pray with you. And I am very sure that testimonies will abound after this prayer in the name of Jesus. I'm trusting God that someone in depression is being lifted from that valley. Someone in sadness is being lifted, is being healed with a balm of Gilead. Someone whose sorrow has filled his or her heart. As you are watching this right now, healing comes to your heart now. And the joy of the Lord becomes your strength. Shall we pray? Dear Father, we thank you for today. 
Thank you for the privilege to see the end of January. Thank you for the privilege to see my birthday. Thank you for my friends, well wishers all around the world. Thank you, faithful Father, for your sustaining grace over our lives and over their lives. Be exalted in Jesus' name. I connect them now with the grace of joy. I connect them now with the token of happiness. I connect them now, O oh God, with the joy that is overflowing in our hearts as we celebrate today. And I ask of you that you remove every form of sadness, every token of depression in every life in the name of Jesus. That soul that is depressed, that spirit, I command you to take your leave now in the name of Jesus. That person there that is having a migraine kind of headache, that is having issue of blood, having problem with your stomach, having problem with any part of your digestive system, I command the healing of the Almighty God to flow through your systems now in the name of Jesus. That one that is looking for job, you have been trying, writing application to various kind of workplaces, you know, all, all the while, and nothing has come out from it. I command that there is a shift for you, and I speak into your life, enter into your door of good employment in the mighty name of Jesus. That person having deteriorating health issue, receive your healing right now in the mighty name of Jesus. That person having suicidal thoughts, and life is kind of hopeless for him or her i command in the name of jesus receive comfort and receive joy receive a brand new hope for your life in the mighty name of jesus every prayer request that is in the heart of your people oh god for this year or even for the ones that they have been aspiring for you to do for them all the while lord i pray let there be manifestation and answers to those requests in the mighty name of jesus in all, oh God, we pray you will keep us advancing in our walk with you. We will not be tired, we will not be weary. Thank you, Holy Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. See you at the video of Obairi. God bless you. It solves the magic Oba ton fun mi la yo ton shogo olugori mi soke kare oba olupeja titi la ni ma fo pe fun o o se un sala re ku ma ye ni kan iwo ni kan loye mu akan mi yo ma fi ibukun fo oluwa eni mi yo ma gorin si emi ti gbe oluwa kai waju mi akoleshi mi ni po Ninu Christi my own father must be for it be here of our soul like so long Mo fi o se igbe kan le mi Jehovah mo mi like bu aye ja Ningba ti mo wa lo mo kekere o lu toju mi Alagbara lo luwa to nba mi mo ni irin ajo mi o mo mi la agiju aye ja o mo mi ja gbanga Jesus, Jawa, Mama, fi mi si le te si wa ju pelu mi. Oka mi yo ma fi boko folu wa e ko mi yo ma gorin si. Emi ti ke olu wa ka yu wa ju mi akole shi mi ni po. Di nu kisi ma yo fanda ma si foni da bi ra fo pato la e to lor. Ofi o se ibe kele mi Jehovah mo mi lai bu aye ja La ye lorun ta la le fi yo we ale da ase da o ngogo o ma se ni bi re la ye titi dorun o ta bi ni sale o si fa to gbira ga si olojo si o si de ni ifi bu O se n lo gbara re ko ma ye ni kan abi ta lo le mu bo he akan mi yo ma fi ibukun fo oluwa enu mi yo ma gorin si emi ti go oluwa kai waju mi akole shi mi ni po ninu kristi ma yo fanda ma si forin da bi ra ko pa to laye to lorun mo fi o se igbe kan le mi ji o ba mummy like bu aye ja